Hello, welcome everybody to another Facebook Friday, right? Another Frilici Friday. Oh, second Friday already in July. It's an awesome summer, right? Like, oh, I got my 4th of July, my red, white, and blue dress on today, a kind of an honor of 4th of July since we just had that on Monday. I hope you guys had an awesome holiday weekend. Um, I spent some time with some friends over at Lake Michigan over um, in Muskegon and um, Matt Lily was there. Kate ended up going to hang out with some other friends at another um, cottage and um, you know water kind of fun. Um, so missed him but um, had lots of fun with Lily and my sister and nieces and other friends and so yeah it was a great holiday weekend and I hope you guys had a great weekend and 4th of July. Hello, Miss Philomena. Welcome. So you guys, I get to show you the inside of the catalog. If you haven't seen already, thank you for sharing the video too, Miss Philomena. The new July to December, my holiday mini catalog. I still love to call it. And we can actually show you the inside of the cat. Well, that's not really working very well, is it? Anyway, but yes. Yeah, so if you do not have one of these catalogs, please let me know. I would love to get one sent out to you or put out on the porch for you. We also have begun celebration again too. So if you're not familiar with celebration, this is a fun promotion that Stampin' Up! Hello Lynn, how are you? Uh, they do it twice a year now. So we did it back in like January and February. And now the second celebration, second edition is July and August. So for every $50 you spend and you could order a product out of the new, again, the holiday mini catalog or our annual catalog, which I feel like we barely had this catalog as well. We've got so many great fun products in here to play with. Hello Danielle. So order out of either of these catalogs, spend $50 in product, and you get to pick one of these celebration items. Hello, Kim. Thanks for joining us. We do have a couple of items that are free with a $100 order. So again, if you order $100 in product, so that's before tax and shipping, just keep that in mind. Um, you can pick one of the um, $100 items. Hi, Bonnie. Thanks for sharing. I appreciate that. So yeah, lots of good stuff. I'm going to show you guys that we can kind of flip through here, um, but we've got some fun. The hippos, I shared that um, fun stamp set and die set with you guys um, on our last Facebook Live. Hello, Janina, welcome. So many people, probably lots of people are off this week, aren't they? I, I didn't even really think about that, but I've got lots of faces popping on. I love, I know a lot of people aren't able to watch normally on Friday afternoon, so this is so fun to see so many um, familiar names and faces popping on here. Um, beautiful Rings of Love Designer Series paper. We've got these, and these are beautiful. I just opened these up and played with these. We're gonna actually make a card today at our card class this afternoon using these are the pool party and soft sea foam cards and envelopes and they're beautiful um this is another the stylish sketches stamp set you guys can't even see these probably right we've got some gold and silver designer series paper on um, this fun amazing phrases stamp set this is one that's free with a 100 dollars order the um, tree lot dies also free with a $100 order and I'll show you guys those a little bit more closely. And then lastly, this is what we're gonna play with today. Hi, Robin. Oh, what she's saying, I was just going to make another, ah. <laughs> That's too funny. Yeah. Well, coffee is always a good thing in the morning. I guess it's still morning, right? Um, but anyway, yes, we are playing with this is the wonderful world, the stamp set, and then the designer series paper. That's what we're going to make projects with today on Facebook Live. This is products so the stamp set and the dies, or sorry, uh, designer series paper free with a $100 order. And is that it? Then we've got a host stamp set, the perfect pomegranate host stamp set. Hello, Jamie. Um, you can get that stamp set free with a cumulative $300 in order. So if you put one big order in, if you get a bunch of friends and family together, or if you just want to put one big whopping order in yourself, you can get the perfect pomegranate stamp set for free as well. So, so many good things. I can't wait. I've got um, the starter kit stuff. I'm going to show you guys that in just a little bit. We've got so many good things to share. Also, <clears throat> we are doing another designer series paper share. I should reiterate though that I actually still have two paper shares left. I kind of over ordered. Um, so I guess I'll just have to keep the paper if nobody else wants it. But if you're still interested in the annual catalog paper share, um, I'll have to post the link because I can't remember how much that paper share is anymore. Um, but I can post that link too if you still um, were thinking that you might want to get one of the paper shares from all of the paper in our annual catalog. Still have two left. <laughs> 
if you're interested. Then also, I just announced we're gonna do another paper share from the holiday mini catalog. So let me show you. I think I figured out, I don't know if there are like 16 different packs of paper. Did I write it on here? Yes, I did. Actually, I made myself some notes for this one. So there are 16 packs of designer series paper and specialty paper in our holiday catalog. So I'm just gonna kinda zoom up in here so you can see this is all of our designer series paper. So we got a ton of packages of paper right there, the designer series paper. And then, cause that's one, two, three, yeah, that's 12, right? Three times four is 12, yep. And then we must have um, four more packages. Of, we've got some, um, let's see, some glimmer specialty paper that are probably, it looks like silver, gold, and maybe kind of a vanilla champagne-y color. Um, the metallic shimmer paper, specialty paper. The real red and white glimmer paper. The um, snowflake specialty vellum and the snowy white sheets. So I don't know, you guys can't really see very well, but I basically included all of the paper that I possibly could. Hi, Brian, how are you? Um, let's see, I included, yeah, so I basically included all of the specialty paper, again, and the designer series paper in the paper share. That is 16 different packs of paper. You get a quarter of a pack of each of those papers in the holiday catalog plus the host does that that's what's throwing me i'm like the numbers don't add up because one of those they 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 missed they messed me up and actually oh i did that too my first email that i sent out about the designer series paper share my numbers were off because i was charging you for the host paper which is actually free so i think i originally said it was 57 dollars. it's only 52 dollars for this holiday catalog paper share because you're automatically going to get the host, yeah, oh, okay, you can kind of see. You're gonna get a little sample of that host designer series paper for free. You're also going to get some of those pool party and soft sea foam cards and envelopes. I'm gonna give you a little sample of those, one of the celebration items. And then you're also gonna get both of the packages of designer series paper. So you're gonna get that gold and silver specialty paper and then the other one, it's the Rings of Love, which actually I have right here also. You're gonna get a sample of the Rings of Love designer series paper, all that for free when you spend $52 on the paper share. So hopefully that makes sense. I'm gonna say it one more time. 16 different packs of paper from the holiday catalog, it's $52. Then you get the host designer series paper from the holiday catalog, two packs of celebration designer series paper, and the note cards and envelopes from celebration, all for free. So I have the link, I will um, include that above the details to this Facebook Live video after I get it uploaded when we're all done here um, this afternoon, and then I've been even Emailing about it too. Um, like I said, the original email I sent had the wrong price listed in it, but basically the PayPal link is just to send PayPal money to me and you just type in $52 instead of $57 and you're all good. Um, it is $10 to have it shipped to you though if you do need it uh, shipped to you rather than the porch pickup option. So, But lots of beautiful paper. Can't wait to get my hands on. I've only seen a little bit of it, um, but the paper, we always do such a fabulous job stamping up. We, <laughs> we stamping up up. always does a fabulous job on their designer series papers so you're gonna want all of that paper too I'm just sure of it so um, oh okay so I have to show you a fun card that my friend Jennifer sent to me she was playing with the happiness abounds stamp set which I have to tell you I was kind of afraid of like coloring this stamp set but not anymore not after I've seen her card like look at so she used some of the um, blends I'm sure this is probably Bermuda Bay and pool party but do you see kind of all of the shading and detail that she created and then that's some of the um, hues of happiness designer series paper with that little friend um, stamp on there and then um, the brick um, uh, embossing folder and then some fun little gems and she just on the inside she even stamped another another flower right there and she just said Amy hope you enjoy my attempt with the hues of happiness sweet heart Jennifer so the funniest thing was this is one of the friends of mine that I get together with um, two times a year and we do like a girls crafting weekend just like four of us together we all we trade houses and all kind of host each other um, but she she texted us recently in our little group chat she was like I need to get your addresses because I've made these beautiful cards and I need to send them out to people that will appreciate them and she knew that 
we would obviously appreciate them. So beautiful card, again, by Miss Jennifer, featuring the Happiness Abounds stamp set. And like I said, just so that stamp right there is what she used on those flowers, and they're just gorgeous. So she did a beautiful job with her coloring. So thanks for sharing that with us, Jennifer. Um, okay, let's see what else. Check out my notes. Oh, just want to do a quick reminder. Um, let's see. So I'm not sure, Janina, what you, you've listed maybe a couple of names there. I'm not sure what you're referring to. I don't know if I missed another um, comment that you made. I'm sorry if I did. I apologize. I'm not sure what your names are for, um, but maybe fill me in, okay? Um, so quick reminder, the super summer giveaway, we've been doing this. So we, we've been through the month of June, still going on in July and August. Just want to remind you guys, because the big thing, especially in our Facebook group, is you get your name entered into the super summer giveaway drawing if you post pictures of projects that you've made and use the hashtag super summer giveaway if you do that post on our facebook group right here anytime we'd love to see what you guys are oh i see sharing with friends okay thank you that's too funny thank you for sharing with friends too i really appreciate that that did not even dawn on me that's how sad like i'm not even like thinking that way but thank you <laughs> now i get it makes perfect sense <laughs> that's awesome okay so yes back to my drawing so basically i'm going to give away fun products from our new holiday catalog and our annual catalog we'll do the drawing in September, but you get entries all summer long, one event for every event that you attend. And then attending also includes, say for example, if you do one of the class to go kits, I can consider that like attending an event. So you get one entry for um, attending an event or participating in the class to go. Um, you get two entries for every $50 you spend. So that's at an event or online. Um, so I've been watching and every time people put orders in all month long, I've been putting your names in the drawing, right? You get two entries. I started to say this, but I got sidetracked for each picture of a project that you post right here to our Facebook group using that hashtag super summer giveaway. If you bring a new guest to class, you get another two entries into the drawing. If you join a club, which includes simple, beautiful card club, scrapbook club, club, class to go kit club, paper pumpkin, and in color club. I'll still accept people if you're interested in getting the new in colors in the in color club. You get three entries into the drawing if you join any of those clubs. If you buy the starter kit, you get five entries into the drawing. And if you hold a private party or class, and we could do it right here uh, locally at the church here in Alma, or uh, we could figure out how to do something online as well, you get five entries into the drawing for hosting a private party or class. So just wanted to make sure you guys were all aware of that, especially, like I said, you know, long distance. I know that feels like it's a little bit harder to participate and get your name in the drawing, but if you order online and if you post pictures of projects you've made right here to our Facebook group, you get entries in the drawing. So I'll be excited um, to give away lots of fun product in September. Um, at the end of summer, we're not talking about that yet though, right? Uh, okay. I think we are ready. We're going to do our first drawing for the heart pearls. And it's very hard, I think, to tell, but they are little baby hearts, kind of in a few different shades. Um, and I think they describe them, but one's a little, I don't know, I'm not even going to try to describe them, but there's three different kind of shades of white in the pearls. And there are kind of smaller pearls and bigger pearls, but they're super pretty. Okay, so you get your name right here in the drawing. I got lots of entries in here. If you shared the Facebook Live video, if you signed up for my email list, the link is always above the details to this Facebook Live uh, video too. And then also if you share the class to go kit post, you get it, your entry, you get another entry into this drawing. Okay, hello, Miss Susan, welcome. Okay, so here we go. One lucky winner will receive the heart pearls. These are beautiful new pearls from our annual catalog. And my lucky winner is, thanks for sharing, Miss Deb Northrup. All right, congratulations, Deb. You are the winner of the heart pearls. So I'll bring these to you and get them to you at class today, actually. So I'm gonna go put them over here on the counter so I don't forget that. Okay, good, very good. All right, so I'm gonna dump these things out. So we're ready for the next drawing. Okay, and what are we gonna give away? On our next Facebook Live, if you share this video, share the class to go kit post, 
or sign up for my email list. Those are the three ways you get your name in the drawing to win. These are the beautiful, these are the 2021-23 opal rounds, the in color opal rounds, which I just love. Those beautiful kind of soft, they seem kind of pastel-y on here, which I guess maybe they kind of are, but they're beautiful. And you can kind of bend these colors too to be the color that you need. So if you're not specifically using one of our in colors that came out last year, um, I think you can kind of make them work for other colors too. So love these, um, yeah, the opal round. So they've got that kind of opal, like, I don't know, can you see kind of all the glitteriness behind the colors too? So they're beautiful. So that's what we'll give away on our next Facebook Live. Um, what else do I want to share? Oh, I know. We need to congratulate Miss Shauna Hughes. So she is one of our Inkspired stampers, and she just reached what's called qualified team member, meaning she bought the starter kit and she's gotten to $900 in sales under her own demo ID. So she became a qualified team member in our team and our expired stampers. So I love to recognize people who are um, kind of advancing in terms of titles. So she receives a $25 shopping spree from me. And then actually she will get a charm necklace or keychain when she promotes to Bronze Elite. She's halfway to Bronze Elite because that's at $1,800 in sales. So like I said, right now she's at um, like over $900 dollars in sales she's over halfway there right so she'll get a charm necklace or keychain when she promotes to bronzy lee and then she actually gets a charm uh, for becoming a qualified team member as well. So she'll get a couple of charms in her charm necklace or keychain when she gets to bronze elite. So congratulations Miss Shauna that's kind of a fun um stepping stone like i said halfway to bronzy lee and getting 25 percent of her 25 percent discount on all of her orders so you guys know right starter kit actually let me make sure i give you all the proper details so during celebration they always do like a fun extra special starter kit deal and i am super excited to share the products that you are getting so this is a little bit different they actually have like a set kind of extra set of products that they're going to give away when you buy the starter kit during celebration. So that is anytime in July or anytime in August. Uh, you guys are so sweet on your congratulations too, thank you. Um, okay, so buy the starter kit, you get to, and this is kind of always the standard deal, you get to pick $125 in product and you pay only $99 plus sales tax. So I kind of like to think of it as anytime that you wanna order more than $100 in product, you might wanna think about getting the starter kit because it's actually cheaper to get the starter kit because you only pay $99 plus sales tax that 11 percent shipping fee is waived also um, so it's like totally cheaper to get the starter kit than it is to buy like a hundred dollars in product like you know off the rack off the you know online shopping site um, plus then you get 20 percent off of all future orders like I said, when you get advanced and you get to what's called bronze elite status, you actually get a 25% discount off of your orders. So, but the other fun thing is, so in addition to $125 in product, you can pick anything you want. I always kind of jokingly say, you could get like $125 in dimensionals and snail refills if that's what you wanted, if you felt like you had everything else, which whoever thinks they have everything else that they want, right? That's the problem is we all want so much. That's why you should get the starter kit and then get your 20% discount on everything else that you order after that and there's no pressure to like demonstrate or hold classes or you know do Facebook lives or any of that obviously that's an opportunity if you're interested in I'm happy to help kind of get you set up so that you could you know learn how to do those things but there's no pressure if you don't you know if you just want to buy the starter kit and get your discount that's what most people do they they kind of um, like a, a term people use is like a hobby demonstrator like oh it's just a hobby of mine totally fine that's what like probably 99% of demonstrators there are like over 50 probably close to 60,000 demonstrators all over the world so you're one of a huge group of lucky ladies who have recognized the awesome deal with the starter kit and then right now you also get it's called the making plans collection and this is what you get in it. and I'm going to show you all of these things in just a sec and I'm going to try to read this without my glasses on you get a planner notebooks and a stamp set so the 
and it's actually a July 2022 through December 2023. So like a year and a half worth of planner pages in there. You get three super cute creative journals or notebooks, and then you get the making plans stamp set. So, okay, let me just show you because it's this whole, like this was their 30th anniversary motif, which would have been back in like 2018 because we started in 1988, right? 88, 98, 2008, yep, 2018. <laughs> so I love the print on here, right? And it's got, so this is one of my favorite things. It's got like a magnet in there, so it like closes. Storm, storm. Oh boy, I was really hoping this wouldn't happen. We'll see if he starts going. Yeah, well hopefully he's upstairs, so maybe you can't hear him too well. I will just digress for a moment that recently, hello Tracy, my next door neighbor, they got a dog. Um, and every time they let the dog out, the dog barks and 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 barks. So then when their dog is outside barking, then Stormy is like, well, I need to bark back. So he goes crazy upstairs so it's not quite as loud, right? So hopefully you guys can't hear him too much. Drives me nuts though. So anyway, okay, back to um, the planner, right? So it's beautiful. Like I love even the binding is like this Calypso coral, that beautiful floral print, the awesome um, clip kind of thing that holds it closed, right? And I will tell you one more thing too. I am still since like, I think it was in college when I started using a Franklin planner, uh, totally get made a fun of for this. Um, but this reminds me like it's basically like a Franklin planner right here. So when I saw that they were giving these away, I was like, oh my gosh, I can't wait to see what it looks like. So, okay, so here's the inside and it's so cute on the inside too, right? Okay, so they give you a bunch of stickers in here that you can kind of use on your pages. Well, let me just show you. So you've got two sheets of kind of floral. Um, oh, and they've got like little arrows and things on them. So you get two of those sheets. And then another fun like, okay, so the idea is this is probably supposed to help you kind of keep your stamping up orders and business or whatever organized. So they've got lots of little stickers like event, order, on tour, backstage, urgent, appointment, blah, 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 blah. Oh, this is funny. How about this one? I love lists. I probably should like put that right on my chest. Like that's totally me. I have like scribble lists everywhere. Okay, so, but isn't, okay, can you guys see like how I put those in there? But look at how pretty the inside of the planner is too with the little stripes. And then you've got some pockets like for credit cards or business cards or something, right? Can you guys tell I'm totally geeking on this? Like seriously. Okay, and then they've got these tabs right here. They're actually 10 different tabs, if you can see that, with the beautiful kind of shiny, um, like I love the print on here too. And I just put in, so here's the calendar, the 2022. And then on the back side, it's got the 2023 calendar. And then it's got these, so the monthly planner pages. So there's July. I've got all of the monthly planner pages in here for, um, this goes through the end of the year, so through 2022. And then I think like on the next tab, you've got some more, you've got lots of room to um, just kind of make notes. I put some more planner pages in here from 2023. Um, what else can you do? Oh, then we've got lots of kind of blank pages where you can doodle again, make lists and notes. So there's this kind of style with that pretty um, kind of edge to it. And then here on the back side, right? So I got a bunch of those pages. And then did I put, I guess I did the next tab. Then here's another one, right? So here's this page. And then on the back side, we've got some, like, isn't it? It's just so pretty. Like, it's just going to make you happy to, like, work and use this planner, I think. So you could just do whatever you want. There are a lot, just so many, like, these are all just blank pages. So they give you a bunch of blank pages. And then, did I put any more in? I'm trying to remember. Oh, I know what I did. So in addition to the monthly tabs, they also have, let me show you. Oops, I guess I put a, oh, I know, I put a few of them in. Okay, so here is the um, July, right? Like the monthly planner. And then behind that, then I put in, so they've got these pages, like you can go by week. So they've got like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So you can put kind of more detail because obviously that little calendar doesn't give you lots of room and then they've got lots more room. And they gave you, well, what, 52 and 26 or whatever that math is. I'm sure they gave you at least that many. So for every single week for the rest of this year and all of next year, you've got these two page spreads 
where you can put more detail in. So, okay, seriously, it's just so, like here's the, the last little tab, but you can kind of see all the tabs one through 12. So you could put, you know, you could put addresses in here, other lists, doctors, you know, whatever you like to kind of, you know, you need to keep track of, right? So, and then, oh, you can put a little pen right there. And then again, it just is like a little magnet. It just shuts right up so nicely. Okay, so awesome planner, free with the starter kit right now, right? And then, and actually I'll show you. So these are all of the other pages that come with it. Like I couldn't even, you can't fit them all in there. So you, you know, maybe put like a week, a month or two in there at a time of like weekly pages. So you've got tons and tons of extra pages, right? And then you also, Stormy is still barking. I don't know if you can hear him. Okay, so then these are the little notebooks. You get three notebooks. So again, that beautiful print. And they're all a little bit different. Like this one is just blank. Yeah, they're all blank pages. I want to make sure. Yeah. So you can doodle, right? Whatever you want inside there, right? Then we've got this fun one with the kind of stripey look to it. And then this one has the dots. I don't know. Can you guys see that? Right? So I think this is great, like for drawing. I'm not, I can't, not very like creative like that, but I'm sure people that are um, love to use this kind of like dot grid paper to do that. And then one more with the little polka dots. And then this one is lined pages. So if you can see, right there too. So three cute little notebooks also. And then this awesome stamp set, the making plans stamp set. So I'm going to read. Oh yeah. These, so these are kind of like the stickers too. Like we've got for your or, Oh, <laughs> there we go. Maybe you'd say like, thank you for your order. That's awesome. Right. Then there's like notes to do goals on this day. Um, let's see all the things wish list making keeping keep track of stuff lists oh and there's low copyright stampin up also so if you do happen to make projects and you want to sell them you've got your little copyright stampin up stamp that you can put on the back of your projects so you can sell them um, and then we've got that thank you and the plans and then some other fun little imagery there so you guys all I get like oh all of this stuff is what you get for free plus $125 in product and you pay only $99 plus sales tax that 11% shipping fee is waived. So if you're interested in getting that awesome planner and all the other fun uh, notebooks and stamp set, let me know if you have any questions. I'd love for you to become a part of our Inspired Stampers team. I have um, info, uh, more details on that. I've been emailing about it and it's posted on my blog at gatheringinspiration.com too if you want more info on what it means to become an inspired stamper so i won't go on and on anymore but love to have you become a part of our team if you're interested in that and get your 20 percent discount on all future orders okay i think we are ready to do our next drawing uh, let's see oh yay okay we are gonna give away the hippest hippos stamp set um oh robin is asking let's see how much do you have to order per month to keep the discount. Okay, so they actually do it on a quarterly basis rather than a monthly basis. If you order $300 in products, so that's before tax and shipping, but it's also before your discount too. So if you put in one big order in a quarter of $300, you're gonna get your 20% discount and then you still pay the tax and the shipping on that. But that 20% discount kind of essentially washes out that tax and shipping on your order. Um, so $300 in a quarter. Right now we are in the very beginning of the third quarter. They actually don't count the partial quarter that you start in. So June, July, August, wait, I'm sorry, July, August, September, October, November, this, you have until December 31st to put $300 in orders in. They count, so if you order, if you bought the starter kit today on July 8th, if you put an order in on July 9th of $300, you'd be good through the end of the year, okay? And then it's $300 every single quarter after that. So next January, February, March, $300. April, May, June, $300. July, August, September, $300. And if you don't reach that $300 in orders, nothing happens other than you can't get onto the Stampin' Up! website and order any longer. Basically your demo ID drops, nothing else happens. I like to keep track of things and let you know kind of where you're at. Cause I know like I'm into this a lot more than a lot of people are. So I like to make sure you guys always know where you're at just for information purposes. I will never hound you and say, you gotta do, you gotta do. I just let you know, and then you decide what you wanna do from there. So, 
Yeah, but you get, like I said, you get that 20% discount on the $300 too. And you get host benefits. So if you put a $300 order in, you get that, I think it's 12% in host benefits. You get all the celebration freebies. So for every $50 order that you put in, you get to get a free celebration item. So, so many, this is a, the most amazing time to get the starter kit because you get that super cute planner too, which everyone can use a little more organization in their lives, right? So, okay. All right, so let me know if you have any other questions on that. Okay, so we're gonna give away the Hippest Hippos stamp set that we played with on our last Facebook Live and the Coordinating Hippo Dies, right? If you put an order in of at least $30 through me and use the host code, your name is in the drawing to get that stamp set and dies, you are automatically, as a thank you for me, going to get the two Hippest Hippo cards that I made on our last Facebook Live. And if you bumped your order up to $50, so in June, you got to pick from either the June PDF tutorial or the June free embellishment, right? Um, so let's see. I think that's all I wanted to share with you guys, right? So you always get the cards that I demonstrate. If you bump your order up to $50, now you're going to get, um, actually, where is that? This is the free embellishment for July, the little um, fun what are they? The fun flower resin shapes or the July PDF tutorial. And you get a free celebration choice, right? Um, and I'll tell you what we're gonna draw on our next Facebook Live in just a minute. But let's go ahead and do our drawing now for the stamp set and the dies. So we've got names in here. Um, a couple, I have a couple orders, but you guys, I say this every time, right? I do not get a ton of online orders. So your chances are always so good, really good of winning the drawing. Okay, so one lucky winner will get the Hippest Hippo stamp set and the coordinating dies. And that winner, oops, I have two, make sure there's only one, is Miss Robin. All right, congratulations, Miss Robin Wellens is the winner of the Hippest Hippo stamp set and the dies. Congratulations. Okay, so on our next Facebook Live, in addition, did I say celebration too, right? You get a free celebration choice if you spend $50. <laughs> yay, I know, yay. <laughs> All right, so next Facebook Live, your name will go on the drawing to win. This is the In Color Glimmer Paper. So we've got the Parakeet Party, Tahitian Tide, Orchid Oasis, uh, Sweet Sorbet, and stormy seriously chill out and starry sky so now there's like a fedex truck driving by and that's the other thing that you have to bark at even if they don't stop at the house they think that he thinks that they might stop at the house so man he's on fire right now <laughs> anyway sorry Whew. okay so yes your name will go in the drawing to win the glimmer paper and it's kind of an ombre too right hi k so can you see it's like a little bit darker to lighter on each of them and there's the tahitian tide there's the orchid oasis the sweet sorbet and it actually i don't know if it looks a little bit more and then there is starry sky or maybe vice versa sometimes those get confused yeah, I think that was Starry Sky. Anyway, so you get a whole package. This is what I'm gonna give away on our next Facebook Live if you order through me and use the host code. There is a new host code for July. It's posted on my blog, and I will show it uh, when we flip the camera down in just a moment, okay? All right, so I have more to share with you guys. I got a bunch of swap cards uh, using Celebration products, so I wanna show those to you, but I thought it would be better to flip the camera down and show them to you with the camera flipped down so that they're not backwards, okay? So, let me, I think we're good. Yep, let's, um, we're gonna flip the camera down now and I'm gonna share with you my, <laughs> that's awesome, you lost one pound this week and the hippos, yippee! <laughs> yes, which for a holiday week, that's really, really good because I hopped on the scale and I was like, oh, why did I do that? <laughs> That did not happen for me. <laughs> okay, all right, so turn your heads away. We're flying through the air. We're gonna flip the camera down and we're gonna look at some swaps and then we're gonna do our stamping. All right, hold on just a moment, ladies. Okay. There we go. All right, I think, are we done bouncing? Let's see. Flip that down. Okay, good. There. So we have our celebration brochure. Good, Storm. Thank you for just relaxing. These big brown eyes are looking at me like, what's the problem, Mom? <laughs> You're too loud, Stormy. That's what the problem is. 
Okay, so I'm just gonna flip this open and I'm gonna kind of just go in order. So we have the Hippest Hippo stamp set and the Hippo dies that Robin just won. And check out this super cute. And we're actually gonna have to open this one. So this was a swap from Debbie Mosick. And it's gotta have some kind of a cool fold on it, right? So we'll have to, we're probably not gonna open all of them, but oh yes. Oh, look at how cute that is. Okay, so there, oh my gosh, look at that. And so it will stand up like that. How cute is that, right? And then you can write on the back side of it. Oh my gosh, that is awesome. Look at that, yeah. Okay, so you kind of get the idea, right? You can kind of see. Super duper cute, love that swap. She did a fabulous job on that. Okay, then um, what do we have? Oh, the Rings of Love Designer Series paper. So actually I should back up. These were both free. The stamp set free with a $50 order and the dies free with a $50 order. This Designer Series paper, Rings of Love, free with a $50 order. We've got a number, I'm gonna just show you. There's this one here with little sending hugs on it. Then we've got, here's another. This is beautiful too, isn't that paper? You are amazing beyond measure. Here's another pretty one with that house paper. So that's again in this Rings of Love Designer Series paper with the I Miss You. And then here's a little, so sorry, with those little birdies, kind of watercolor wash look, right? So these are all great examples of projects you could make using that Rings of Love Designer Series paper, again, free with a $50 order. Then we have, oh, okay, so I have to open this one up because these are the Pool Party and Soft Seafoam cards and envelopes. And let's see, we'll just pull that one right out there. Let's see, so here, this is one of the cards. So this is obviously a pool party card, right? Hello, Pam, how are you? And then on the inside, so it's just got the white on the inside, which generally our cardstock, if it were pool party cardstock, it would be pool party all the way through. But a lot of times with these um, special like cards and envelopes, they do have a white on the inside, which is handy too. Then you don't have to put a white piece of paper on the inside. But I love that embossing folder on there too. I'm not even sure which one that is. So I'm gonna have to check that out. Love this. This ribbon here also with the twine there and then here is one of the envelopes and isn't that so cute the envelopes are all this with the uh, soft sea foam on the outside and then the pool party kind of print lined on the inside and then you get 10 pool party and then another 10 of these soft sea foam cards so beautiful huh and a little print on the back there too right Okay, um, the Stylish Sketches stamp set is another. These are both free with $50 orders. So here's an example of a card made with the Stylish Sketches stamp set. And isn't that cool? She really did just um, like a little bit of kind of shading on there too, but beautiful, simple, right? And then one more with the Hello You. And then again, I think that's gonna be a popular paper to use with that stamp set, right? Okay, then we have the silver and gold six by six inch designer series paper. And here's this, woohoo, you did it. And we're actually gonna make this card similar anyway um, at class today, because I loved the fact that she used the amazing phrases stamp set free with a $100, $100 order. And then here is the silver and gold designer series paper on that stripe right there. So yeah, can you guys see so many great ideas with this with all of these beautiful products from Celebration, free with your $50 and $100 orders, right? Here's another little woohoo, and she actually, maybe she cut that, I'm thinking she cut that now that I'm looking at that, because the stamp actually looks like this. So I bet she cut it and then layered, right, it on her clear black, which is totally acceptable to do, right? To do her little woohoo on that fun little circle decorative circle punch I think and then this is some more of that rings of love designer series paper that is free during celebration also then we also have okay so here's another little woohoo right and then check this one out I love these the little tree lot dies free with a $100 order these are all super cute examples and then look at this one it's, it looks it's like fourth of July right with this um this the designer series paper and then that cute little <laughs> oh my gosh, it's such a cute little trailer there, right? So, so, so cute. And then one more featuring the tree lot dies, right? And the other fun thing is this 
set of dies coordinates with the trees for sale stamp set that is in the January, or excuse me, the July to December mini catalog. And actually says in very, very small print, it's on page 39 of that catalog. And I think I did bring, yeah. So here are all of these dies. And then this is the trees for sale stamp set. So this stamp set and this set of dies free, right? So you can order this, order some other things to get to $100, and then you can get this set of dies for free with your $100 order. And you can make a cute card just like that using that stamp set and dies, right? Yay! Oh my gosh, so many cute things during celebration. I want to show you guys um, a little bit more. This is that gold and silver designer series paper I wanted to show you. So they've got polka dots and stripes basically in gold and in silver. And then here is the, hello Roseanne, how are you? This is that Rings of Love designer series paper and we'll kind of just show you the fronts and backs. I love that plaid too, right? There are the houses, actually it's kind of, we would go like that, right? And then the, that's just beautiful, that like mosaic print, the birdies on there. Brenda, hello, welcome, welcome. We've got kind of a pretty watercolor wash there and then some kind of fall print and pattern there, right? And then it is beautiful, isn't it, Susan? Oh, there is that one that they used on that side. <laughs> Storm! See, the FedEx guy, all he did was drive by. They hear him. It's like they hear the brakes on the FedEx trucks. He's not even stopping, Storm. You don't have to worry about it, okay? So yes, these are just little samples. Actually, club member treats this month is what I'm giving away is a little sample of the designer series paper from the Celebration brochures. Okay, I think we are ready to do our stamping, right? Okay, um, let's see. We are going to grab... What I need here, actually, I'm going to show you that host code for a sec while I get organized. This is our new host code for July, the 93FNG2KT. Okay, and get my grid paper. Okay, so this is what always tells me whether I'm like in Hello, Miss Debbie, whether I'm in view or not. Okay, you lay down and relax, Stormy. <laughs> He's not a very good listener, though. Okay, I have to get my little sip of water. Okay, okay, so I think I told you guys this already. Where's my stamp set? Crafter math, ladies. Okay, so we are gonna feature the Wonderful World stamp set and the Wonderful World designer series paper on our projects. And I know I used some pattern. Actually, I think I used this pattern on um, the Hippo cards last month, right? But there's the back side of that one. Um, did I? No, I'm trying to remember. Maybe I did, or last, yeah. So we're going to use this paper and this paper actually today on our card. I'll show you that in just a sec. But this is, again, I know I use that stripey paper too. So this is free, the stamp set and the designer series paper with your $100 order. But I just wanted you guys to kind of get a peek at all the pretty patterns in this paper. And that's the last one right there, right? Okay, so full pack of 12 by 12 designer series paper and the Wonderful World stamp set. And you could make a project like this one. So we've got the beautiful designer series paper, that stamp, and then some cool frames. And I love this ribbon and the little thank you. So let me share with you how we are going to make this one. Oh, here, I'll show you these dies while I'm thinking about it. These are the Fabulous Frames dies. So we're going to use that little guy and that little guy. And I've seen this used, and it's beautiful. And then there's that cool thing. These look like, are they photo corners? I haven't even used those yet, but that's kind of what I'm thinking those are. Okay. Oh, and actually, while I'm thinking about it, let me just show you a couple more swaps featuring this stamp set, the Wonderful World stamp set and, and dies. So there's that one. Isn't that beautiful? And then with all that pretty paper, right? And then that one right there. So beautiful. Lots of great projects that you can make. Okay, so let's see here. Let me pull these things out. Okay. All right, so let me give you measurements first. We are going to start with a Sahara Sand card base. So full sheet of 11 inch by eight and a half inch. We're going to cut it 
at five and a half inches in half along that 11 inch side. And then along the eight and a half inch side, we're gonna score it at four and a quarter inches, okay? So there's our card base. Then we have a piece of gorgeous grape cardstock that measures four inches by five and a quarter inches, okay? And then these two pieces of designer series paper, and they are the same size. They both measure two and one quarter by three and three quarters. And then we've got just a couple of scrap pieces of basic white and Sahara sand to do our stamping and die cutting, okay? All right, so let's do our stamping on this one and this one. We have our gorgeous grape ink. Of course, we're using gorgeous grape ink because that coordinates with our gorgeous grape card stock. So we've got this beautiful flower. This is probably my favorite stamp in that stamp set. And that looks super dark. I wonder if I stamped off. Maybe we're gonna do that. Let's see what that would look like. I have my little, my little grid paper to do my stamping off on. Okay, so we're gonna stamp it once and we'll dry it right there. Yeah, that's what we're gonna use, right? So can you see? And actually I think you get a little bit more detail then too when there's not quite as much ink on that stamp. Okay, and then we're gonna stamp our little thank you on our just our little strip. There we go. Isn't that so cute? Don't you wish you could write like that? <laughs> I know I do. <laughs> okay, and that stamp is actually from the Go To Greetings stamp set. This is one of my favorite. I love greeting stamp sets, and then especially with all that beautiful scrolly uh, cursive writing. And then these are just as beautiful too, right? And then the little baby ones. So yeah, we used that thank you right there on this one. Okay, so let's see. I think we're good. We're going to do our die cutting now. Okay, actually, you know what? Oh, I didn't bring my, I was going to clean these off, but I forgot to bring my cleaner. So we're not going to be cleaning those off. There's always something that I forget, right? <sighs> I'm whispering that, so maybe you won't remember, right? Hi, Lisa. How are you doing? Okay, so we are going to have to run the label frame thingy through twice. We're going to put our thank you on there and we're going to put our this guy on here, okay? So we're going to try to move. And you guys know, right, if if you just have to move your paper if things are flinging around there, okay? All right, so we're going to crank these through here. And then we're going to cut one more. Sorry. All right, wiggle, wiggle. So I have to show you guys because I think this is a really cute little thing, right? Okay. So look at that little label right there. And then it's got the two little dots. Super cute, right? Okay. And then we are going to... Okay, so this kind of will stick right in there. Let's see if I do that. I'm trying to get it released. There we go. So you just fling it on the table and it pops right out. So you've got that cool frame that we can use for another project another day. And then here is our flower on that oval stamp, right? <laughs> this time difference, I know. It's hard keeping track of those things, isn't it, Lisa? That's funny. Okay, so then we're gonna just put this right on here because we need um, the little frame. The Sahara sand outline is what we're looking for on this one. Okay. So let's see. And again, that frame is right in there. We're just gonna fling it on the table a time or two, and look at that, it just popped right out. How about that? And then you can keep this little oval for something else too. Okay, so let's get these things. We're actually making this card at class today too, so I've gotta keep stuff intact so I can take it with me to class in a few minutes. Okay, so. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I forgot a couple of things, didn't I? But I think we're gonna be all right. I know, yes. Okay, so let's see. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, so we're gonna add some adhesive behind our designer series paper. Run it and tip it back. Okay. All right, there's the, put this one down. Can you guys see what's going on? I'm like so involved in what I'm doing here. Okay, that one goes there. This one goes here and it's not gonna matter there's that 
space in between there because we're going to use this beautiful, I love this, it's like a linen, right? Is that what do they even call it? The natural finish ribbon, but it looks like a linen, linen pants or something to me, right? So we're going to just run that. There we go. And another thing I wanted to share with you, because you could also use, this is that combo pack that's in the annual catalog. This is beautiful ribbon also. The twill ribbon in Sahara sand and old olive would work really well with this paper too. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. That would be another option if you have that one. So we're just going to run that around there. We're gonna flip it over. I'm gonna add some adhesive and just Kind of add that one right on there and that one right on there and then we're going to run some more adhesive so that we can add this piece right to our card base okay so there's that now we are going to flip this guy over which is the front that is the front okay so we're going to just kind of layer this right inside of each other and then i'm going to grab Hopefully it's straight, right? Maybe we'll put one on and see, because that'll kind of hold things together. Yep, I think that looks good, okay. So we're gonna just add our dimensionals all the way around, catching the white and then the Sahara sand frame behind it. So again, that'll kind of hold things together for us. Thank you guys, let's see, we've got, uh, I'm just checking my comments here. I'm glad you like this card, Miss Susan. Okay, and then here's our little thank you. We're gonna add just a couple of little, oops, our little mini dimensionals work perfectly on that little mini guy, okay? Just peel those off, put that little thank you right about there, and then we're gonna finish it off with some of our iridescent pearls, which are some of the new, they're just a little bit different. You, it's really hard to tell in the light, but they're they're beautiful. They just got a little bit more, um, I don't know, iridescence to them, right? That's probably why they're called iridescent pearls, right? They're just shiny and beautiful. And they kind of pick up, you know, like the purples in this card kind of get picked up on those iridescent pearls too. So there we go, super simple, right? Featuring again, lots of product from Celebration and then our um, annual catalog as well. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. This is actually the swap card that I made um, earlier, I guess it was at the end of June, that then I received all those swap cards that I just showed you. So this is my celebration swap card, and then I got all those others in return, which is a wonderful way to get ideas, right? Through the swap cards. Okay, so. That was card number one. I'm actually gonna put that right over here. Okay, I think we're good, right? So moving on, we got card number two, and this is another beauty, right? Again, featuring more. Thank you, Robin, I know, always simple. I'm definitely the simple stamper, but um, that's the thing is you don't really have to do too much. Just, we've got so many beautiful products, and this is another great example of that, right? So here is, let me find that stamp set again. Right, so we've got the Wonderful World stamp set. So on our last card, we used this beautiful flower image right here. And then this time we're gonna use just that one right there. We're gonna just die cut that right out. This I think is a lily too. It's very pretty also. Yes, okay, so let's get these things out. And I'll tell you about the rest of the products too that we used on this card. Let's talk about measurements first though, okay? And then we'll move on to what we're playing with here. Okay, so this time we have a piece of pear pizzazz cardstock. Along the eight and a half inch side, we cut it at four and a quarter inches. And then along the 11 inch side, we scored it at five and a half inches. So we're making a tall card like that one, okay? Then we have a piece of basic white cardstock that we're going to emboss three and three quarter by five inches, okay? And then I have a couple of pieces of that Wonderful World Celebration Designer Series paper, again, free with your $100 order, the DSP and the stamp set. And then I have just a bunch of basic white, um, what is this, pear pizzazz and blushing bride cardstock to do our stamping and die carding, okay? And then we use the little Sending Hugs stamp, which is from 
what stamp set? You know, I think I took it with me down to card class. I think it's from a new stamp set in the holiday catalog. Let me see if I can find it because it's one. Um, I've only ordered a few things so far out of the holiday catalog, but it was one, yes, right here. This beautiful Splendid Thoughts suite. The paper is gorgeous. So here is the stamp set in very, can you guys see there's the little sending hugs stamp set from the Splendid Thoughts. <laughs> it is splendid, isn't it? Yes, it is, Miss Brenda. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, um, so let's see. We're going to do our stamp. We always do the stamping and die cutting, and then I'll show you how to put it all together. Okay, so we're going to use our Blushing Bride card or ink pad, okay? We have our big flower stamp. All we really want is that, but I want you guys to see how pretty this is. So we're going to stamp all of this right on here. Doesn't even matter that I got an edge on that because we're gonna just cut that one right out there. But you guys see how pretty that is, right? Okay, and then on our other little piece, we're gonna use our Pear Pizzazz ink and our Sending Hugs stamp. We're gonna just stamp that right on there. Okay, that looks a little, hmm, I don't think I like how that stamps. So we're gonna try that again. Here we go, that one's better. Okay. Let's just take this stuff out of the way, right? Okay, so now we are going to do, we have actually a bunch of die cutting to do because I don't know if you guys saw, but I actually used the deckled rectangle dies. Can you guys kind of see? Kind of, it's almost like ripped paper around the edges, but I love the look of that. So we're gonna use those here and then we're also gonna do our die cutting and then we have embossing to do too. So actually let's do our embossing first. We'll get that done. Okay, oops, I should have put that down first. Okay, so we have the time-worn type embossing folder. So this is one of our 3D embossing folders. Just kind of, it's almost like typing, I guess. I don't know, like it faded over time, right? Actually, we will make that straight. There we go, okay. So we're gonna just run this through our die cutting and embossing machine. All right, sorry, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. We'll get those right out of the way now. Okay, so check this out. Oops, there we go, see it on that side? <laughs> it just kind of is like texture. I mean, there are kind of words, but I don't have any idea what they say. I guess if I trade really hard, I don't know, maybe it's even upside down, <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> but anyway, it's kind of a cool embossing folder. Okay. So that's that. Next, we are going to do some die cutting. And I'll show you guys these, the deckled rectangles. Okay, so we've got that one and that one. And we'll do this little baby too. So we're going to have to do a couple runs through here. But let me show you what we're working with for these. Okay. So we have our layering circle dies. And we're going to use the largest... This straight edge is gonna go on there, and then this other one is gonna go on here, and that one. The next time we're gonna cut this out of Blushing Bride ink, okay? But we really, that just needs to make sure it's on anywhere on the paper, and then these we have to get kind of lined up here. Okay, I think those look good. Where's my top? There we go. Oh, I should have done one of the rectangles. Oh well, to do that couple runs, but that's okay. We'll get them all cut. Okay, so here's our little scallop edge circle. I still love these dies. Been using these for forever now, it feels like, but they're just so cute. And our little sending hug, so that's just going to layer right on there, so you just get that little hint behind there. Okay, and then, so I just cut that flower right out of there, right? And, okay, so we're going to do this one, and then, oh, let's, let me show you guys these, the deckled rectangles, so they're kind of moving around, but you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven different sizes of rectangles with that little kind of, like I said, that like ripped edge on the paper. Okay, so we got that one and that one. Cranking these through, and we'll do one more. 
with our other designer series paper. Okay, so there's another little scallop edge for our flower. And check this out, isn't this cool? You can just kind of see, it's like, it's really kind of like a scratchy edge all around there, right? Okay, and we're gonna do one more. Let's crank this right back through here. That one right on there. Oops, there we go. And last rectangle, here we come. And maybe you can see it a little bit better on this one. Can you see that the little edge on there, right? Isn't that cool? I just love that. All right, we got all of our die cutting done. So we can scoot that out of the way. All right, I think we have everything now. Okay, so here again, this is the card we're gonna make. I'm gonna scoot that right off to the side a little bit. Okay, so we can add adhesive and you wanna use a good amount of adhesive on these projects when you're when you have embossing right so oh, let's see um what is that die called oh these i think maybe you're asking about are called the deckled d-e-c-k-l-e-d deckled rectangles dies and it's item code 159173 which reminds me i will have all of the product names, item codes, dimensions, like measurements, colors, everything that you would need to recreate these projects to order um, on my blog. And I'm actually tomorrow, because I have class this afternoon, so I'm not going to be able to get everything uploaded because I got to run out to class in a few minutes, actually. Um, but I'll have it all uploaded tomorrow. Um, so if you need any more details, or just ask me right now too, yes. <laughs> and I'm happy to do that as well. But if, I, if I'm not speaking, I get super excited and then I start like stumbling over my words sometimes. So I'm not always speaking as clearly as I should. I've never taken like a real like public speaking class, I don't think. So um, yeah, I get a little, my words get a little fumbled up sometimes when I just get so excited. Uh, but anyway, but yeah, ask me questions too. I hope I can see your questions as I'm doing because I get like so involved in like putting these things together too that sometimes I might miss a comment. So, but yeah, we're going to just put those together. Okay, so we just added adhesive behind those. We're going to put some dimensionals behind these little guys now. Um, let's see, yep, we're going to add these. And so we're gonna put our little flower, maybe right about there. Yes, but those deckled rectangles, I've used them a ton already. Um, I have to make sure I take them to class too, because I've got another card at class that, one or two maybe, I feel like, <laughs> that we're using them on. Okay, so this is some soft sea foam. Yep, soft sea foam, and it's a seam binding ribbon, which we've had seam binding ribbon in the past that was a lot more flimsy. This is like a little bit thicker and sturdier. So just kind of know that I was expecting when I ordered this seam binding ribbon that it was gonna be really floppy like the other ribbon, which I loved because you could like crinkle it up and make it look really vintage and you know kind of worn. Um, but this is a little bit more substantial and sturdy. Um, so a little bit, um, in some ways, a little bit easier to work with, I guess. Um, or if you weren't a fan of that super kind of floppy ribbon that we had before, know that this isn't quite like that. Um, whether that was a good thing for you or a bad thing, I don't know. I loved it, but it did take some getting used to. Some people did not really um, like that other seam binding ribbon so well. So, you know, it's all preferences, right? But we're going to tie a pretty soft sea foam seam binding ribbon right there and this is ribbon that is in our holiday the july to december holiday catalog oh i thought storm was gonna make it through storm Shh. okay he's running upstairs at least that'll help us a little bit right okay so last step is to add a couple of our opal rounds okay so i'm gonna add one of the big opal rounds right in the center of our flower and then I added just a couple more. I put one there and I put one on the little sending. Actually, maybe I'll put it right there. That space a little bit more, right? Okay, so there we go. There is our second card, again, featuring that wonderful world stamp set from Celebration and then the designer series paper, free with your $100 order. Okay, so 
Let me grab, let's see, we got that one there. Do my quick little recap in case you're new to Facebook Live, right? My little sticky, make sure you bring these dies to class, right? <laughs> it's gonna get lost in the shuffle, that's for sure. Okay, so here we go, right? If you put at least a $30 order in through me online using this host code right here, you're gonna get both of these projects as a thank you from me, right? If you, oh, what else? Uh, you're also gonna get your name in the drawing to win that in color, sparkly, glimmery designer series paper, right? Bump your order up to $50 and you get to pick from the Demo Design Dream Team PDF tutorial or the free embellishment this month, month, which is the fun flower resin shapes. Plus you get a free celebration choice right now too. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you hanging out with me today. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Hopefully summer is being good to you and you're enjoying the heat, right? We've got it now for sure, huh ladies? So thanks so much guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm glad you enjoyed the cards and we'll see you soon. Bye everybody.